Hi guys, Ryu here with another video for Blender. This one I'm going to show you some cool tricks with mats that you might not know of. So the first one's going to be how to create a copy of a mat. So if you have a cube, right, and you're going to add some mat to it with hard ops. So by simply pressing Alt M, so you press Alt M and you add a mat, right? And then you duplicate that cube. You're going to have the same mat on both of them. What if you like the, for example, you know, the specularity and roughness and all these settings on this mod, but you wanted to change just the color. If you start playing with that, you know, color or, or the tonality, whatever, you would change it on both of them, right? So to create a copy of the same mod on a separate object, what you need to do is come here and click on that number and then you can change whatever you want without um, altering the original material. Second tip I'm going to give you is that what if you didn't have any mats in the scene, okay? So let's just, you know, create a clean scene and I'm going to have a cube, right? And um, I'm going to add the mat to this cube, okay? So Alt M mat. So I have one material in my scene, okay? So if I expand this here, you will see that I have only one mat. What if I wanted to add material to these faces, right? I would need to, you know, click on a plus and, you know, create a new material and then assign it. It's a lot of work. So what you can do, right, is you can select, press Q with um, hard ups and simply click on the mod. And this will add a secondary mod to, you know, to these faces. You don't have to click anything. OK, so now, you know, I can adjust this mod right here. So let me just go to this view here you can adjust this mod here in you know on these faces and this one you know separately right and there you go now the last trick i want to show you is with a cutter so so when you have a cube right and you want to slice it okay and um and when you slice this you will have the same mod in the middle here as you have on the cube now you can change it by going to the menu and simply clicking here and selecting material so you could for example select the yellow one and when you cut it you're going to cut it with a mat but what if you wanted to change this uh, after you cut or during the cut um you know to something else you can do that by simply pressing m so when you uh, draw a cut and you you know you in a drawing mode when you start pressing m you can shift between all the mats in your scene and kind of flip you know between them until you decide what you want boom sorted and it will continue you know with all the cuts further on and this one will stay the same okay guys well that's it these are my tips for blender and hard ups and box cutter so hope you enjoyed it give us a like and sub if you did now if you would like to learn more tricks and tips on box cutter and hard ups we have a massive course on it called ultimate guide to hard ups and box cutter and also we have a free course for hard ups and box cutter on our website link in the video description so if you're interested hop on that and enjoy. Cheers, see you later.